to the flow now. Ooh. Texas, ain't no hold em. So lay our thoughts down, 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 down. Just pack your Lexus and throw your keys up. Stick around, round, 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 round. round. And I'll be damned if I is crazy. What the? Hey besties, it's your girl Kelly Nari, and we are back with another video. As you can tell by the caption and the thumbnail, today we are going to be doing some hygiene shopping at Target. Listen, if you're not subscribed yet, go ahead and press that subscribe button. Press the bell next to the subscribe button so you don't miss another video from me. And I'm getting ready to walk into Target, so let's get into it. Tornado, tornado, my city, my city, yeah, the basement, the basement. That shit ain't pretty, pretty. rugged whiskey. We're surviving. We're surviving. I'm ready to get this week redemption back in time. It's the longest. <sighs> yeah, I saw him over here now, girls. And I really been wanting to try this, and I'm going to. But it's the um rosemary mint scalp and hair strengthening oil. It's a scalp treatment, and it helps for split ends and stuff like that. Um, I don't know if y'all know, but I do have like flaky scalp or dandruff or whatever you want to call it. But I feel that the peppermint actually helps with that in a way. So, yeah. I want to actually try this. This one is $10.49 for this. So, comment down below if y'all have used this. <laughs> I've been wanting to try it. And I'm glad that I actually came over here so I can get it. But as far as anything else over here in this area, I probably don't need anything. But I just walked past this area over here and I feel like this is new because I haven't seen it. Um, Let's see what this is. The Wide Awake Eye Serum. What does it have in here? These are like steps, I guess, to their products or whatnot. I love a good serum. It has peptides, vitamin C, caffeine, and adaptogens in here to help fight the signs of aging, which is interesting. This seems like it's gone the most. Like everything else, this one too, the moisturizer, looks like this is gone too, so this must be good. Interesting. And then this one is a fruit facial exfoliating face scrub. Let's see what the exfoliation is in here. Oh, it has AHAs in here. So I'm gonna use it two to three times per week like I told y'all. Make sure y'all are using that sunscreen. Oh, it has glycolic acid in there. Grape seed exfoliants and chia seed oil. Ooh. Oh, it has a nice toner with glycolic acid or glycolic in there, 10% toner. <sighs> hmm. Oh, and they have some stuff for the inside. Some little chews in here. Y'all know I've been trying to avoid those though. Like I'll take anything in like a pill form. Oh, this one is for your hair too. A scalp detox. Oh, we was just talking about that. Power scrub, scalp detox. Well, we was just talking about this. The body facial exfoliating scrub. Body oil. We was just talking about this. Let's see what this is. Scrub, shampoo, purify, a two-in-one clarifying treatment. It has shampoo and a detoxifying European salt scrub. I don't know how I would feel. I never... I never did that before. Direct, uh, apply directly onto wet hair and scalp. Gently massage into a lather. <sighs> I gotta do a little bit more research on a scalp scrub. Like, I just, I don't know. I have to do a little bit more research before I, I buy this. But this seems pretty interesting. So, I'm gonna look into a job. I'm gonna tell y'all what I find and if I actually like it. We don't know. Flat body scrubber. 
Yeah, I don't need that. Ooh, y'all, my stomach is hurting so bad. We over here in the skincare. Bioderma is over there, and they got some big, big stuff over there. They move stuff around in this Target. I haven't been to this Target in a while, so all this stuff over here looks new to me because they move stuff around. But they have this, which is new, Bioderma. It's a makeup remover and a cleanser, and it's good for sensitive skin. I know buy a dumber is good for that. This one is $21.99. And this one is a foamy gel. What is this? Ultra soothing balm. Oh, this is good for itching, very dry and irritated sensitive skin. This is for my sensitive skin. Gross, I be going through what I be going through. But um, I don't actually have like... Hmm, this one is $27.99. Interesting. Let's see, what does it have in here? Oh, it has a skin barrier called a Autoderm Intensive Balm. So this is some stuff they done made. Huh, interesting. Oh, they put, oh, okay. So they got all the clean and natural skincare stuff over here. This is really what I'm about over here. This clean, natural skincare. That's good for my sensitive skin. Girls, all that, all that. And they have good molecules over here. I didn't even know that they had this over here. They got a hyaluronic acid serum, which is good for hydrating and plumping your skin. What is this? Wake up eye gel? Hmm. Oh, it's in like a... Oh, I like that they show you like how to layer. So you cleanse, tone, and then you put on the eye gel. You moisturize and then put on your sunscreen. Super cool. I feel like how like acid body lotion i did tell y'all about this too when we were talking about exfoliating if y'all haven't seen that video go ahead and look for that video because i talked like literally everything that's good in 2024 for exfoliating your skin and the products that i would use if i wanted to exfoliate and this is a good body lotion i did i'm gonna list that up in the corner somewhere so y'all can see it and this is only um $16.99 so yeah it's fragrance free so it doesn't have any fragrance in there but it is hydrating because it has that shea butter in there so good but yeah I'm trying to see if I want anything over here marshmallow roots barrier balm that looks good oh they finally got the oh no they don't I was gonna say they probably oh they do they have the super serum this one has niacinamide hyaluronic acid and retinol in there and i've been looking for this because i'm like girl uh, i'm tired of trying to put in oops my bad i'm tired of having to put on so many serums and this one is 25.99 yeah i'm getting this i've been looking for this because what I have been doing is getting Art Naturals and I'll get this retinol, then I'll get the hyaluronic acid, and then I had some niacinamide. And I was like, mm, that's just, it's just been too much. Oh, and they have the vitamin C complex cleanser right here. It has vitamin C, fruit enzymes, and folic ac oh, phytic acid. This is really good for... Having your skin look so glowy. And it dissolves makeup, oil, and dirt and stuff. And this is $17.99. I have this at home. This is a really good cleanser. Um, 
stops excess oil production but it does hydrate your skin and it makes it look super glowy my stomach is on a million right now I've been wanting to try this um aloe vera cleanser I want to try it and see how I feel about it, but I just, girl, I need to quit because I'll be going to town. All these gummies. I don't know, gummy, nothing. Hydrogel patches. Oh, it's supposed to help well, like, regulate your mood and stuff. I'm looking over here with the um, scrubs and stuff. And it's either they just didn't bring the new stuff or they don't have none. Oh, shoot. Eco Tools got some ice rollers. Look, I feel like this is new. Yeah, it says new. Ice roller is good to stop like the puffiness in your skin and stuff like that. Y'all see it? Yeah. But this one is $11.99. I feel like theirs is like super bulky because I like to get under the eyes. Like a lot so under the eyes. And it's just bigger than what I would want it to be. I'm looking over here to see if I want any masks or anything, but I don't. I don't need any. I'm good. Okay. I don't see any new lotions that I want, but they do have this um us fragrance free lotion it's 8.99 like the rest of them but um yeah they didn't used to have that here so i just wanted to show y'all that um, but yeah i don't see anything else over here They have an aloe vera too. This helps with sunburn. Y'all, I need to get some stuff for. I keep saying that. I keep saying I need to get some stuff for my hair. I did get the little scalp treatment. I feel like that's good enough <laughs> for right now. Okay, so we're over here in the body care section with the body wash. I do not see nothing new. It be killing me every time. Every time I come here, I don't see nothing new. It seems like they're trying to get rid of this. Y'all, they're trying to get rid of it. They're trying to get rid of the body love collection. Oh my God. But I just seen where Walmart has um, a new like collection type deal. And it looks like they're trying to get rid of all of the body. Mighty curls. Why is that over here? Trying to get rid of all of the body scrubs from Raw Sugar because they have it on sale right now. It's marked down. Trying to see. I don't see nothing else over here that I want y'all. But let me show you my favorite, favorite ones. This coconut and cocoa butters is so good with the Dove um, coconut and shea deodorant they have. The one with VitaCare, it smells so good. They're a VitaCare brand. It's just top tier. Um, 
And then this one, obviously, the antibacterial. I really like using this. That smells good. And it has a higher percentage of the antibacterial active ingredient in there than that stinky dial antibacterial soap over there. <laughs> and then um, this right here is my favorite to the shake butter and vanilla smells so good. That is so good. And then the lavender and chamomile. I literally use this every time i feel like i need to relax it gives me relaxing vibes this cucumber and green tea smells so refreshing like literally what it says that's exactly what it smells like really love it and the um aloe and eucalyptus oil is really good on days where i just don't feel good <sighs> and somebody was like oh my god girl why do you have so many um body washes and that's why because i take I don't know, I just take this whole thing so serious because I feel like when you're in the bathroom in the shower and just getting yourself together, I really consider that a time to show myself a whole bunch of care. So like that's my self-care, self-love, you know. Looking at the Dove aluminum collection right here that they do have, I feel like they should have the Dove VitaCare over here, but they don't. They have it on the other side, which is super weird. But I absolutely love this coconut and pink jasmine, and it's affordable. It's $6.99. Love, love, love that one. And they have a sensitive one that's 0% aluminum as well. That's $6.99. But this is literally my fave. Like, when I first started this Dove, this 0% aluminum journey, I started with this coconut and pink jasmine and fell in love, love. I tried every last one of them, honestly, all of the scents, but I love this one, and there's a pomegranate one that I love too. So yeah, these are really, really good. Um, I It never failed me though. That's all I'm saying. Like I never had an issue with it not working. Ooh. I heard this bio freeze was good when you were dealing with like pain and stuff. But girls be using this on their feet when they be walking in heels and stuff this and then it was another one what do y'all think about that like do y'all feel like that's a hack or do you feel like you shouldn't use that yeah it was this lidocaine but it was a spray like a lidocaine spray and it might be somewhere over here yeah it's literally it's somewhere over here girl but yeah, how do y'all feel about that? Like, what do y'all think? Y'all think it's just a little bit too overboard because your feet, like, the pain that you get in your feet might damage you if you walk on it too long? Like, what you thinking? What you thinking? Y'all, I'm wearing right now the Always Pure Cotton, and I'm not to sound crazy or trifling, but I got up this morning, and it was like... Not even this morning, I ain't gonna lie to you. I was like 12 when I finally did wake up because I was up all night. And I got up, got in the shower, got dressed, whatever, put on my pad. And I don't even know, I think it's like 5 o'clock right now. Let me see. Yeah, it's like 5.07. And I had it on since earlier and it's not overflowing, not nothing, not doing nothing crazy. Um, but it's because I've been outside like working since I got up. So it ain't been on no nasty stuff it's just like sometimes you just can't get to the bathroom um all the time so yeah and i'm gonna show you what i'm talking about what pad i'm talking about because it's really it's really that one like it's really goaded right now hold on okay so i'm like i had to zip this camera up baby if y'all don't know, yeah. But yeah, anyways, I might as well talk to y'all while I'm doing this. But the Pure Cotton, anyways, they all, they have this Flexi Foam that is saying that it's zero leaks, zero feels. Like the Pure Cotton that I get is the exact same. And if you're not too worried about the chlorine and the dyes and the bleaching and stuff, they do have that for a much cheaper, or not a much cheaper price. It looks like it's the same price, honestly. Um... <laughs> Which is crazy to me. I would I would think that it's more expensive to create this stuff the right way. And if it's not, then why not just create it the right way? Uh, so this is the kind I was telling y'all about. These always pads. And then this is the pure cotton one. 
this is the one I'm wearing three for a heavy flow extra heavy flow honestly I like using this because that's how my period is like when it first start and it literally only lasts like three days and then this is 22 in here and this one is eight dollars and 99 cents for the 22 inside of here but when I tell y'all like this absorbs so much like I absolutely love this and like I said they do have a regular kind if you're not too worried about it and that one has actually 28 pads in there so a little bit more than the 22 and it is eight dollars and 99 cents so it's the same amount but you actually have a little bit more in there if you don't care about having the, that dye and that chlorine in there um this one is called the flexi foam infinity by always so yeah but i love the pure cotton one because i don't want to have to worry about none of that extra stuff like honestly so i mean it's better for me to like have my conscience clear than for me to be like oh no i don't know but another thing too i used to love using the l brand and they changed their packaging <laughs> so i low-key almost didn't recognize <laughs> that this was the brand but i would tell you that three is probably the same or equivalent to this which is the l brand and this one has 100 percent pure cotton so no chlorine is chlorine free on the top layer it has no dyes no synthetic pesticides no fragrances and stuff like that and then this one is um nine dollars and 19 cents for 36 pads so this actually has a lot more in there um for a little bit more so nine dollars and 19 cents and then they also have a regular that has 42 inside of here and these are nine dollars and 19 cents here so yeah they are a little bit more expensive here on the 42 with the l brand versus at walmart so I'll take that with a grain of salt but i really believe that the always brand is the same exact pricing at walmart than it is here so yeah um I don't know. I bet I love L brand. Like I was using L until they came out with this pure cotton by always for the flexi foam. And when I tell y'all, I've been the happiest girl with them because not saying that the L brand pads are super thick. They aren't, but the absorbency, you can notice a big difference in always versus the L brand. Like always like absorbency is absolutely crazy. <laughs> Absolutely crazy. I like really love it. But it looks like they actually have gone out of the sensitive wipes with the box here that I would normally take with me. So with like the individual wipes. And but they have this one which is nine dollars and eighty nine cents and it has more in here, so it has thirty and this one it only had fifteen. But the convenience of you having like um separate little toiletries that's probably why it was a little bit more than if you are to just get this one and even though the pricing looks crazy like imagine if you bought two of these that's like ten dollars ten eleven dollars twelve dollars actually twelve dollars and then this is like 9.89 for 30 by itself so yeah but i absolutely absolutely love this adore them and then their wash is like nine dollars and 89 cents here i think it's like eight dollars and something at target but it is like $6.99 at TJ Maxx. So TJ Maxx is a lot cheaper. I love TJ Maxx so freaking much when it comes to feminine hygiene. Because, girl, they be doing a big one. A big one. But I don't need any more of that. And I'm trying to see if they got some more stuff over here. But they don't. And this lady walked down here and was looking for a powder. And she didn't even know that there was a powder right here and i wish i could have talked to her before she left but this one is 359 this powder is so freaking good i love using this for areas that are sweaty <laughs> and it's 100 percent talcum free so i use this all the time that's so good but yeah i don't see anything that i need to re-up on because i still got some more of my badges still at home so yeah i might leave from over here i took a small I took a small intermission because I was trying to get my camera together on my phone, but I need to um, go down this oral care section. Okay, so yeah, remember I was telling y'all about the Coco Cabana, Coco and whatever that was called, Coco and something, the body wash. 
the coconut body wash by Dove. This is what it smells like, and that smells so good. Even though this is $11.99, I swear on everything, this helped me with discoloration. <laughs> Oh my god. And they have this, but I don't know. This is aluminum free, but I'd be scared of native deodorants and I really want to put that where it needs to go because that stuff burnt me. Oh, all of Grin's is gone. This is all the Grin um floss picks. They're gone. So it's a like and Part of the reason why I haven't gotten a lot of stuff in here is because, like, most of the stuff is gone. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. Yeah, so I was actually thinking about getting some more stuff from Walmart. So I think I'm going to go into Walmart and get some stuff. I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to Walmart and get some stuff because, girl, uh, there's not enough stuff in here. And, yeah. Oh, they got some um good toothpaste for kids. I haven't seen this one. This little watermelon burst toothpaste. Look, y'all. Interesting, because I've never seen it inside of this thing like this. You in the world? How do you use it? Have y'all seen this? And it's sugar-free. It doesn't have any sugar in here. Huh. What does it say? How do you use this? Like, do you just squeeze it out and it comes out like that type of toothpaste? Or like what? Hmm. Maybe they got it like this instead of like this because it's a little bit better to take and move around with you. But it's saying it's a toothpaste and a mouthwash. Ah. That's crazy. Have y'all tried that for y'all kids? I low-key want to see what it's given, but I feel like my son will go crazy. Like he would get that man would that boy would just take it and squeeze it in his mouth and just uh make a whole mess in the bathroom. But y'all I've been trying to find like some um hair care stuff, like some more hair hair care stuff. My curls and whatnots. I've been using Meow, y'all already know, like that's why I ended up purchasing this because I trust her products so freaking much. And then the um Aunt Jackie's or something is called. I've been using her stuff a lot. Oh, we were just speaking about Meow, but anyways, I actually um used her um wash and it was in like a red or like a pink type of thing. Um I've been wanting to try some and let me see what this smell like this rosemary mint shampoo because I like the pink one the pink one smells so good it has my hair smelling good and everything girl but we need to see what this smell like oh this actually smells like the um this actually smells like the um shampoo that my hairstylist be using on my hair and it does give it like a very minty like feel so I kind of want to get this one but it's like open up here so if I can go back around the other way and see if they have some that is not open then I'll get it uh, I feel like I need to get it anyways because I have the hair scalp treatment thing so we're gonna see about it I don't know which way to go for this way? It should be this way over here. Yeah, so it's over here, y'all. And I was looking, I'm like, was it open? And it's, it doesn't look like it was open because all the rest of them look like that. Okay, I'll get it. I'll be here. Go another scalp scrub. It's like, what? And it says scalp treatment. I don't know. It says it removes oil and product buildup to refresh your scalp and it doesn't have any parabens, no sulfates. That's what I be looking for when I'm looking for a product on my freaking hair, y'all. <laughs> on my hair. But yeah, this is, um, this seems like it's pretty good. But again, I do have to see what I do have to see what, what it's doing because I use this one, the pomegranate 
one and it's good for curly hair and I think that's the reason why I ended up getting this um, instead of getting the other stuff like this strengthening and conditioner or strengthening shampoo and stuff like that I feel like my hair is pretty strong and healthy I just need help with like curling so I think that's the reason why I ended up getting this <sighs> But I do still want to try that peppermint one to just, you know, because I really need to wash my hair. Because <laughs> my hair has been... Oh, they have a coiling custard. But I be using Aunt Jackie's for my hair, like my the curly stuff. So I'm thinking, I don't think I want to get them. Like this down here. Like this curling custard, this is what I be using for my hair to like curl my hair up at night. So I'll do like two strand twist and then the next morning I might take the twist out, put my hair up in a ponytail or leave it down or something, whatever. And then this one here actually helps with it to not shrink my curls. And this actually works pretty good, but it has my curls like crunchy a little bit. <laughs> So um, I did use it, but I ran out of it and I never purchased it again because of that reason. But if you're styling your hair for a reason like that, um, for something, for whatever reason, then it's going gonna, it's gonna to get you together. It's going to get you together for that specific day. But I feel like it it just has your hair like super crunchy and i'm well i'm the type of person i'm not i don't want to wash my hair every single day like as a black girl like that strips your oils and stuff out of your hair and you don't want your hair to be dry so yeah with that being said i think i'm about to exit out of here because i've been talking to y'all for a long time i don't have a shine oil but I, I have a few different oils that I'm using on my, or the silk oil. Let me just be honest. I have this silk oil that is good. Um, listen, I've never seen this before in my life. I've never seen a shampoo that had salicylic acid in there, but this has salicylic acid in this shampoo. And I want to see why. Like, what does salicylic acid do for your scalp? It says it fights the symptoms of dandruff, so it's an anti-dandruff shampoo. It has apple cider vinegar in here, and it has salicylic acid in there. I guess salicylic acid is supposed to help with dandruff. It says it helps prevent reoccurring flaking and itching, which is super interesting. But I feel like the peppermint Gosh. should help with that i don't know i'm gonna try what i'm getting right now with the peppermint shampoo and then i'll see from there if i'm need i'm needing something else but i just want to try one thing at a time girl i'm not trying to go too crazy and that one is 13.69 though so that's just so interesting that they're using that for that i just never knew never heard of it never ever heard of it but yeah we're about to be done because i'm absolutely done i'm done so done i'm ready to get up out of here i've been here for a grip i still gotta go to walmart to go see if they have some more stuff there that i couldn't get here and yeah so thanks so much for tuning in with your girl and i will see y'all in my next video bye